Hi, I'm going to show you how to use our Virgo construction submittal tracking template. Here under submission ID, you can change or keep the ID number shown. Under, under description, you can add the details of the submission. Under scope, you can choose from the drop down menu under pre construction structural steel installation or foundation. You can change this by clicking on the edit button here. Here you could change the color, the name, add or delete any of the items found. Once you've done that and modified, make sure to always click on done, apply to all, and click X out next to data validation rules. Here you can add any image or PDF file according to the submission. Here you would record the date submitted and who it was submitted by. Again, you can change this by clicking on edit and changing the name or the color, adding or removing people. Make sure to always click done and X out. Here you would add the estimated response date and here what the response was. If it was accepted, accepted conditionally or rejected. You can also modify this to your liking by clicking the edit button here. Here you would record the response date, the response description, if it was approved as submitted or you have any missing documentation, and if the submission was resubmitted. You would add the resubmission date here, the estimated response for the second resubmission, and here you would record the second response. So from the drop-down menu, it was accepted, accepted conditionally, or rejected. Again, you can modify this by clicking the Edit button and changing the color, adding, deleting, or modifying any of the items. Here you can record the response date of the second response and the response description. Another thing, to add more drop-down menus, you can simply click on the blue on sorry on the blue dot here in the cell and drag it down. And that's how to use our Virgo construction submittal tracking template.